Good morning and greetings. It's day 99 of Walk with Winston. Can you believe it? Oh my goodness, 99 of these videos so far. So, hey, quick, in the comment section below, what should we do to celebrate 100? I'd love to hear your suggestions, comments. I've got an idea, but I'd really like to hear from you. Anyway, this morning I wanted to talk about how your transformation is inevitable. It could feel gradual. It may feel gradual to you, but it's inevitable. If you believe and you take small, consistent, daily actions, your transformation is inevitable. In one respect, if you want to take the contrary view of this, you want to look at it from the, you know, the less than optimistic view, change and transformation is inevitable in the negative direction, right? Uh, we, uh, we're a series of growth and decay, but, um, you know, because we're, we're action people, we're, we're people who love taking massive action and, and like to serve others and, and, and be of service to others, friends and family around us. We just don't settle for inertia and going backwards. We, we take action and move forwards. So today I really, really uh, I want to give you a couple of metaphors, I think, that just kind of underscore this inevitability of transformation. Think about the Grand Canyon. How many millions of years of water beating on that rock to carve out what we consider to be a natural wonder of the world today? Isn't that a, an amazing testament to the inevitability of change? But I'm also really curious about the transformation that um, you're seeing. Yeah, you know, we've been in the 100 day challenge in a small Facebook group. We're two thirds of the way through that now. And I'm seeing already some massive change within the folks there. They're taking daily consistent action and really increasing their energy level, their commitment to doing some scary things that in the beginning kind of scared them, but now feels very natural to them, progressing in their business. And my sister and I this morning were talking about her change. She's physically transformed by over 60 pounds in the last year and a half. And it's funny because she's, she was saying how, uh, you know, that's a huge accomplishment, right? To, to release that much weight back to the world. And she looks so much better. She's so much more energetic. And people who haven't seen her in a while are kind of stunned about her transformation. And then when she comments that it took her a year and a half, they're like, well, gosh, anybody could do that in a year and a half. Well, what I wanted to do is to say, yeah, anybody could do it, but only someone like her that took consistent daily action sees those results. Um, so, you know, many times our transformation is just a journey. And I know for me, sometimes I get so hung up on the end goal that I don't enjoy the walk, don't enjoy the journey itself. And so my encouragement to you is to believe in the inevitability of your change, your transformation, the goals and dreams that you have for your life. Believe in the inevitability of it, but also enjoy every part of the process. One of the things I've noticed recently in my journey is that my belief in the eventual outcome gets strengthened day by day as I'm taking these small, incremental, um, seemingly insignificant steps, but my belief is growing day by day. And the other thing that's happening is that I am transforming. I put on these sweatpants today because it's rather chilly here in Tampa this morning. And I noticed when I put them on, I had to tighten up, I had to tighten up the waistband. Now my overall weight has not changed, but the distribution of my weight is changing very dramatically. And for me, that's the best part of all. Um, I, you know, I could care less what my weight is. What I want to do is to have the most energy, the most vitality, and to be of the most service I can possibly be. So. Friend, your change, your belief in your change is so critical. And I believe in you. 
I am here to support you and I'm so excited for your transformation. So share what you're working on, share the transformation you're already seeing in your life. And maybe you can look back a few years and say, gosh, I'm not where I was. And I'm so grateful for that. I'd love to hear that in the comments and I'd love to connect with you really, really soon. So remember, episode 100 is coming up soon. I'd love to hear your, hear your thoughts about how we should celebrate. With that, you guys have a great day. Talk to you soon.